going to be right into the bag. And we are almost good to go. Perfect. So I'm just going to leave my Doritos bag in this hot water. Right now we're just letting it steam. I'm going to take my taco seasoning and right into the bag. Nothing like adding a little extra seasoning into our Dorito bag. All right, we are almost good to go. Just gonna bounce that around a little bit. Turn this bad boy on high. Now I'm just gonna take some milk and we're just gonna pour a little in. We want a little cream in there. Perfect. Oh, this is amazing. I'm so excited. So now, all I have to do is roll my Dorito bag up. We're going to push to let that meat grind in with the eggs and the Dorito chips. You hear that crunch? That's exactly what we want. We want to crunch it down so this all melts together. Perfect. Perfect. Oh yeah. All right. Now I'm just going to do some tiny spins. You want to evenly distribute that heat. I'm just going to spin it around. Just like so. And this is going to happen super fast because as we know, eggs cook really fast. The tortilla is going to merge with the egg and the beef also cooks really quickly once it's in boiling water. So this is almost ready. The last step I'm going to do is I am going to take my glass plate and I'm going to put it over the pan. So some people like to use lids. I like this because it encapsulates the heat much better and it suction cups to the top of the bag. So that way when you spin it, it's actually much e easier to distribute the heat. So this is exactly what we want. We are almost good to go. I'm super excited to show you the final result. This is so delicious and you can cook an entire meal inside your Doritos bag. If you've tried this before, let me know in the comments below if you know what the name of this dish is. It's a really popular dish in a city. I'm so curious if you know which city I'm talking about. Uh, if you have not tried this, you have got to go to your kitchen right now and give this a try because it honestly is so delicious. All right, 